All right, what do you say we have a look at the NECA Godzilla versus Destroya action figure? Look at that. Yeah, and I said Destroya because that's what it says. Destroya. Talking about going gangster. Yeah. So, you know what? Let's not even hesitate. Let's just curve this open. Not much to see on the package anyway. It says Godzilla, Godzilla versus Destroya. There's a picture of Godzilla. Yeah, and that's it, you know. So let's uh carve into it like a turkey. Oh yeah. I'll try not to make try not to make so much uh plastic noise. I for one don't like it. So I'm well to bet there's plenty of people out there that do not like it either. As I make a bunch of noise. Real quick. I'm hanging on to all of these cards. Because these will actually make cool decorations somewhere. Whether it be on a display cabinet or something. So yeah. Set that over there. And uh, more wire ties? Or no? Looks like uh, no. That's a severe wire tie. That's interesting. It's just got those little plastic... Uh, you know those things that used to hold socks together? Not a giant wire tie at all. It looks like it still may require a knife as I slice it open. Let me see here. Alright, Goyira is almost out of his box. You wonder what that was. It was a tail. Yeah, so again, we have a uh, wireframe tail. So that's how you'll get your uh, posability out of that. Like I said in another review, these early tails were uh, almost ball jointed all the way to this point. Let's have a look at this guy. Oh, his paint is really wicked. You can see the translucency in his uh, scales or plates and in his shoulder. It's interesting how they terminate the uh, translucency into the, the tail here. Just go back to white. Yeah. So you got... Uh, let's get his... Uh, articulation out of the way you got two-piece head you got the head you have the neck and the torso so you have movement in the head and uh, the neck piece here is kind of a pliable rubber and maybe you can see this it's kind of cool no movable jaw jaw on this one but his head will go down a little bit and up Oh, his jaw actually does move. Boy, that's a tight joint. So, close jaw. Open. So you can get you get some movement there. And uh, shoulders. Full swivel. You have a bicep cut, if that's what you want to call it on Godzilla. And you have, I know this is a joint here. Okay, there you are. Not much mo motion there in the uh, elbow. You got a pin, hinge on the wrist, and uh, do we have finger articulation on this one? Uh, that's a negatory. So I uh, have torso movement like so. So you can move it kind of eh, swivel mostly, but no pivot. The legs. We'll do 360, but they look goofy doing so. Then you have a monster hinge on this knee joint right there, and you can get him to do that much of a bend in the knee. Full swivel in the ankle, and a little bit of a rocker. More than I can say for most Hasbro action figures.
Alrighty then. So now, let's get this tail on. Do we dare try it with no heat? Because uh, I know usually how that works out. Oh yeah, forgot about his tail articulation. Before we go putting this, this is a single piece with a wire inserted. So you have a joint there, right at the bottom of the torso. Then you have, uh, oh, so that's a, that's a, that's a two-knuckle joint. Then you have another ball joint there. That's also a two-knuckler. And then you have this section here, segment section, tail section, whatever. But they're all ball jointed, so you can see the motion you're going to get out of that. It's pretty good. So, yeah, let me see if I can just kind of force this on here. With minimal effort. Oh, nice. Must have had my Wheaties today. Actually, I didn't. I did not. In fact, I'm actually kind of hungry. Let's see how he stands. Flat-footed. So, yeah. Alrighty, then. Yeah. Looks pretty good. I like it. Either you love Godzilla or you hate him. Well, I happen to really like him. So yeah, he'll look really good inside my... See, now this is interesting. Look at this. This hand here is actually hinged. Did I miss that? The fingers on this one is actually hinged. And, uh, no, the left hand is not. The right hand is. That is weird. It's probably if he wants to hold a beer or something, get that up to his mouth so he can actually shoot the fire water out. Yeah, very cool. So, yeah, that's been my look at the NECA Godzilla versus Destroyer action figure on the Wolf Out.